Welcome to the madness. Good night, ladies and gentlemen. Guess what we're doing today? Yep. We're going to embark on taking off the twin turbo setup to put on the single turbo. And I don't know what the turbo has to do with the exhaust manifold. Bear with me. So, I'm going to show you what's going on and where I've been and what I've been doing. And then, uh, we'll get into the turning of the wrenches. All right, so to be as transparent as possible, what we're going to be doing is trying to take off all of the wonderful this and figure out how much of it we can throw away. Well, not really, we just need to take it off. So far, I was out here fiddling with wires and I was also naming them. Dasher, dancer, prancer, tis the season for the jay z -ing. But yeah, so this is what's going on. This is the engine. There's numerous things. While they're getting this engine, also prep for <sighs> replacing numerous sensors. I'm not really sure which sensors at the moment I'm going to be totally replacing, but so many things are destroyed. This sensor was crushed. I don't know why. Um, these wonderful little bags were stuffed into this after I took off the cover and looked at it. And this is cut. I don't, I don't know what's going on here. This is broken. No one ever said anything to me about it. <clears throat> you know, just seemed like basic douchebaggery happened when they were taking it out. Um, like, as you see, this wonderful sensor is destroyed. Not even a sensor, this is just a connection point. <clears throat> this is destroyed. Here we go. This is destroyed because, you know, no sense of gentleness. This is going to be changed because clearly someone was playing bumper cars with it. And this was broken. There we go. This was broken because people are horrible. So yeah, like I said, in the midst of, if you're gonna do one of these, if you can't give the thing a once over, be aware that when you unwrap it after the shipping, you're going to encounter many of these things. <sighs> so, all right, we're gonna set you up so you can get a full spectrum, see what's, what I'm doing and we'll be on our way. I got bullshit on that! I need an MRI! I've got soft tissue damage! There's no way I don't have soft tissue damage!
Come on. You can do it. This is your O2 sensor. This is typically the wonderful thing that goes out and when you're going to apply for registration or inspection. And then someone gets to charge you an arm and a leg to replace these. It's a lot of carbon buildup. Try to now find a bunch of workarounds because in the wonderful world of auto or vehicle maintenance mysteriously I don't think the engineers and the mechanics ever talk when they're making anything so pulling it apart gets more complicated as you go along This is a thermostat, clearly given the condition of the rubber, we might need a new one, mysteriously. It's one of the few things I didn't buy. Hot.
melting. Hmm. So, yeah, this is a part of the cooling system, as you can see, wraps from one side of the engine block onto another. It goes all over the car. <coughs> car engine. relatively clear-ish. It'd be a lot clearer if I got this thing off. Finally gave up. Alright, this that I'm holding on to. <sighs> this is what actually holds the car in, in the engine bay. This is what it's sitting on. Um, the mount broke off, and currently the mount, or the bracket itself, is very much in the way of progress. Because I can't get to the one bolt that's back here without wanting to sacrifice my knuckles to the knuckle guts. Victory is mine! Yeah. Celebrate the small ones, people.
Now to see what is happening in here. So, where did the oil come from? And what did I forget to disconnect? Oh, jeez. This thing is heavy. in front of me too. More vacuum things. That was the only thing that was holding this on, right? And there we have it. All of that comes off. This goes on. So. Oh boy. This was a little bit tiring. However. Until the next time, this is Welcome to the Madness. If you like what you see, click like, subscribe, come back, hang out. This will continue. I think the next thing we'll do is in the morning, I'll see how much oil leaks out of the turbo I took off to see if I need to tear into the engine some more. And after that, we need to take off the cover here to see what underneath, or what all these cams look like, to see, um, if we can uh, avoid certain things. Mysteriously, the timing belt is brand new. I, I don't know what's going on. With the same thing with the rear output sheet, the rear output seal, it's brand new also. I don't, I, I have no idea what's, what's what there, but within all of that, the next time we see each other, I will be, I think I need to be taking off this side because we need to prep this side also for the fuel rail system. And, um, other than that, come on back, fellas, ladies, 4% of you. I'm looking at my analytics. <laughs>